Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Ultra Sun, where today we have got us a fire trial to do. And no water moves to do it with. Nor ground moves. Nor really anything that's good against fire. I guess Noi Noi resists fire. But not poison, and poison is probably going to be the bigger danger here, but I am going to heal my Pokemon just so that they can really help us out here. And let's see how this goes. Hi, Kiawe. We've met before. All right. Of course. If it's anything like it was in the previous games... It'll be amusing. Yep. Okay. I'm ready to spot the differences. Okay. The poses are different. By, by using my eyes. Oh, we are fighting a Marowak. Well then. Uh, but it's not the totem. So, if we toss out Inksy here, hopefully... She'll survive the first hit. Oh yeah, just fine. And then we can use foul play and make that Marowak have a really bad time. It occurs to me, Marowak's only really good if you've got a Bone Club item, which our Q-Bone may not have come with. Okay. I think I see the difference. How they're smiling. Apparently that hiker is a Pokemon that Kiawe has under his control. Magmar. Interesting. Here we can leave Zephyra out. Because Zephyra is not really any worse than anyone else against Magmars. Poison even poison? It can. And it's high crit, so. It is a nice move. I just need to see it actually poison something someday. Is that so? So there's no escaping foolishness, then. Is that the case? Because I'm pretty sure you actually sicked him on us. With the whole come my hiker thing. How delightful. There's an extra Marowak! So... Two of these are correct. And 
maybe the totem's cheery. I don't know. And it does have a bone, but... Also, it's a Marowak and not a Salazzle. Interesting. I suppose that means Inksy has a job to do. So, let's see what kind of stats this Marowak has. And actually, Zephyra does have immunity to ground going for and ju really just speed? Interesting. So, Bite is going to be effectively 120 base power, which is more than wing attack, so let's give it a shot, see what happens. Ha! Ah, we outspeed it, which means if we get a flinch here, then we get to laugh. But we didn't get a flinch. So how much damage is this flame wheel going to do? Eh, not too much. Is it going to call a Slazzle? Is that what's going to happen? Hey, yep, that's exactly the thing that happened. Okay. And since a Salazzle is now here, we want to get rid of it. Oh boy, do we want to get rid of it. Um, no, let's just wing attack it. Hey, I'm glad we didn't go for him. Looks like it's going to take one more hit to get rid of her. Ooh. We can't take another round of hits from both of them. But we should be able to get rid of the Salazzle here, which means we shouldn't have to worry about the Marowak. I hope. Oh, hey, it tried to detect again. Good job, doofus. Thanks for the free round. Alright, so now that the Salazzle's out, I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of healing. Healing is good. There's another flame wheel. Yeah, we can take two more flame wheels without really needing to worry about things. So maybe we'll get a flinch here. Yay! Another free round! Oh, I see how it is. If we swapped over to Inksy on a round when it was using Detect, that would be amazing, but these bites are doing just fine for us. Oh no! Now they're not doing just fine for us. Well, with that being the case, Inksy, it's your turn. I wonder if this thing's gonna call anything else or if the Salazzle was all. Ah! Ah! Uh. Okay. Okay, um. What's Noi Noi's defense look like? Oh, I wanted summary, not switch. This could be bad, but Noi Noi does resist fire. Well, that explains the damage output. Don't die, Noi Noi. Thank you. Okay, so... I think Zephyra is the choice here. Zephyr can take one more flame wheel without dying. Unless it crits. And can definitely take a detect without dying. But let's go ahead and super potion here, just to make sure that we can all get out of here alive. Okay. And we should be able to use bite again since we swapped out. So, give it a bite. Yay, we win. Kind of interesting that it only called the one Salazzle. And nothing else. Mike is so close to evolving.
Woe to you, too. Uh huh. Yeah, except they weren't really that fine. They were very obvious. This has been our least devastating trial yet. Can I have a thick club? Ooh, thank you. That's also nice. Okay, have fun with that. You don't appear to be dancing. nothing else up here, so well, let's head on down. Okay, Zephyr is just fine, so... Even if we fight a hiker on our way down, we should be just fine. in fact quite dangerous to Zephyra, but by the look of things we're gonna get around or rather we're gonna get a chance to swap to or uh, before the cadaver shows up so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and use a super potion on Inksy because Inksy doesn't have to care so much about cadabra Probably still a little bit, but not as much. And then... Yeah, let's just cross-poison the bat. Hopefully we won't hurt ourselves. Good. Yay, we poisoned it. And the poison's gonna kill it. Yes, yes I will. Inksy, go. Unfortunately, Kadabra's physical attack is not amazing, so foul play isn't going to be, like, stupid busted. But we shouldn't really have to worry too much about incoming attacks. Whoa, okay. Okay. That's right, it also has, like, zero defense. Hello, TM. I want you. What are you? That could actually be pretty nice. Do we have anyone who can use it? Nope. Hello. 
All right. So, like, have you climbed Everest? Because that's a mountain. And if it's a mountain, you've got to climb it. So I'm going to go ahead and not have Zephyr out front here because rocks against uh, flying types tends to not really be so good for the flying type. Yep, that could have gone bad. In fact, it still could go bad depending on the crits. So if we take five hits, we're boned. But Reflect will make the boning significantly less. And Mud Slap also means nothing. Thanks for the accuracy boost. Here, have some foul play. Yeah, with the reflect up, that is not nearly as bad. Oh. Crits still do full damage to reflect. Good to know. But the rock and roll is dead now. nice that Inksy's actually starting to see some use. She'll evolve in five levels if I remember to hold my 3DS upside down. Seriously. Oh, I would have loved to have one of those, but then again... It probably would have ended up dead like it did in the last run. Jerk. Maybe we got lucky. Maybe our Cubone did come with a thick club. Or maybe we can get one elsewhere. I hope we got lucky. Because being able to have a Cubone do its max damage without needing to work for it would be nice. Or could I use Thief to steal one? Who do I have with Thief? Is it Noi Noi? Does Noi Noi have it? No, I wouldn't put it on Noi Noi. Pauline? Yeah, Pauline's got Thief. So we can swap Pauline in and then... Maybe it'll have a thick club and maybe if we use Thief we can keep it. I don't know if that's how Thief works, but we'll see. Oh, didn't have an item. Pauline looks huge from this camera angle. Uh, let's go ahead and... Hypnosis. Yep. That is dangerous. Hypnosis again. Okay, we need to swap Pauline out. Because if we don't, she will end up dead. Uh, Zephyra, you may be burnt, but you do fly. I think it's like a 10% chance that a Cubone has a thick club. So, yeah, I'll have to check at the Pokemon Center and see whether or not we... Uh, have one on Charlotte. And if we don't, then I might come back here to just grind one out with the thief and whatnot. 
We'll have to see what happens. No, don't get help, don't. Oh, you little jerk. Okay, we need the burn heal. And then we need help. But the burn heal first, because there's no way the two of them would have been able to kill Zephyra in one round. Because that's what a crit headbutt does to her. But let's get some heals here. Well, that's going to make headbutt do more. So let's kill the one that's already used focus energy. Or actually, that's both of them. Still. okay against ground types. His cross poison is easily Zephyr's best attack. Easily. Like, no question. Um, hello. What about me? Yeah, now you're gonna tell me about Poke Pelago, yeah? Or how about you don't, because I don't care. I'm not going to use it on this run. See you never, buddy. Yes, it is. Okay. Malo's trial is a little dangerous. Wait. Did we have to manually go through the tunnel before? In the old games? I don't think we did. I think we just automatically went through. And also, hello. Um, the fact that they're waiting here for us is not to my liking. In fact, it's so not to my liking that I'm going to fly to a Pokemon Center before I deal with them. Because I imagine they're going to want to fight. And if they want to fight, I want health. And I don't want to use all my items to get it. Health, please. Put Noi Noi out front just for the amulet coin action. Sure, we could fly back to the route we were on, but it wouldn't be much faster than just doing this. Hello, you two. Hi. Square. Wait, you don't know what tunnels are? Yeah, it's going fine. Oh. I wouldn't know. I haven't used one. 
again, I wouldn't know. I haven't used a Z-move. Yeah, not really. But you say that I can use them, but I haven't. Ooh. Oh, is it Kukli? He was right over in the Battle Royale Dome. Square. You're going the wrong way. Well, apparently I got all worked up for nothing. So, while there are patches of grass as well as uh, fishing spots on this route, we're not going to use either one. Oh. Oh, you're getting help from him? You, you should look out for him. He's been a bit of a jerk in the past. Oh, square. What is it, Colorus? Sure didn't. Oh. Ooh. Thank you very much. I couldn't tell you. the request. Oh, not gonna tell me, huh? Yeah, uh, there's a Pokemon that I want on this route. But, wow. You're really trying to survey your whole environment, aren't you? Yeah, there's a Pokemon I want on this route, and it's not found in either the grass or the water. And oh boy, do I want it. It's one of my favorites. Yeah, sure, let's bite it. Two more bites should take it out. And what do you know, we get to make the second one for free. Yeah, let's go ahead and switch for Trumby. gets to evolve. Do it. Do it. Gyarados is amazing and I love it. My favorite Gen 1 Pokemon.
though it didn't become my favorite until Gen 2. Because originally I liked Kangaskhan more. But then I started liking Gyarados more in Gen 2, probably because I got the red Gyarados and was like, oh, this is super cool. I like this. So now I prefer blue Gyarados. But whatever. It fires hyper beams in all directions, burning the surrounding area to ash. There are some regions where it's called the Deity of Destruction. Okay. Yay! Yes, we can't talk to him. Seriously, Rodom, stop asking me to take photos with Pokemon when I've evolved them. Ah, good. We can get to him without going through grass. Uh-huh. Oh. Well, getting forced into another battle. Once we get to the Pokemon that I want, then we'll go back through this route. But no sooner. So Stuffle is dark fighting, yeah? So air cutters be just fine. Or no, it's normal fighting, isn't it? I don't even remember. But air cutter is indeed just fine. The fact that Stuffles have tags sticking out of their butts is awkward. to very much not have Noi Noi out front. Because, again, of how ice types mix, or rather don't mix, with flying dragons. Um, what does Gene have? Hmm. Because it's also a rock type. I think I'm just going to go ahead and send Inksy out front. Our team doesn't do very well with rock types. Alright, we can take one more takedown, no problem. And that right there is exactly why we didn't have Noi Noi stay out front. And that right there is why we didn't switch to either Zephyra or uh, Jean. So, uh, Tyrant coming next, I'm guessing? Oh, Almanite. Interesting. Well, in that case, it may still be a rock type, but it's a wet rock type. How'd you break your glasses during that fight, buddy?
Oh, okay. Well, um, it, here's how to get down. Right here. Oh, hey, Hal. I've heard of it, and I'm not using it in this run. Do I... I is there any reason not to? Like, well, yeah, you can get basically super easy EV training there. No, I I know how to visit it. It's in the menu. Yeah, you can also get clothing of different colors there. Oh, seriously, you're forcing me to go here? Hi. Okay. Do I? No. Okay, you said I had to give you an answer, but you didn't say I had to give you an affirmative answer, so no. Seriously, it forces us to say yes, so... Oh, hey, it's some dude. Can't I? Why can't I just leave? Yeah, have a chat, sure. Thanks. Okay, can I leave now? I did the thing. Can't I just leave? Yeah, I don't care about any of these. The only things I care about are the clothes shops where I can get blue clothes. Because I like blue. Alright, you don't get clothes from shops. You get... Uh, it's dye shops is what are things. Seriously, the fact that it forces us to do this is annoying. Yeah, listen to their whispers. Yeah, you use communications. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's rank two. Can I leave now? I want to leave. Can I, can I please leave? I want to leave. Okay, that's fine. I honestly don't care at all. Can I leave? I want to leave. All right, that's great and all, but can I leave? Please let me leave. Yay, I can leave! No, I think what I'm gonna try... No, let me leave! Why are you forcing me into the castle? I don't care about any of this. Yeah, great. You're the receptionist and there's other people too. Got it. Let me leave. Let me leave! Okay, that, that's great. Let me leave. I want to leave. Okay, thanks for just forcing me back here. No, not pretty fun. Pretty boring. Pretty unnecessary. Like, let me choose to go there if I want. Don't just force me there. So let's heal our Pokemon. So... I'm not 100% certain how to properly get the uh, Wimpod, which is what I'm going for here. Like, I know it runs away, 
and you need to not let it. So, uh, like, I just don't know the strategy to actually catch up to it or whatever without it jumping into the water or something. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this episode right here because it's about that time anyway. And then between episodes, I'm going to just look up what I'm supposed to do so that I can do it on my first shot here. So join us next time when I try and get that Wimpod because dang it, I want it. See you then, friends. <laughs>